to prepare for the removal of the fast pass elevator assembly, you want to first go to the front of the library. Make sure that you're on the home screen. Go ahead and park the library or park the handler to the rear by selecting the park rear option. Once the handler has moved to the rear of the library, go ahead and tower off the library. After turning off the power on the front of the library, you want to go ahead and flip the power switch on the back of the library to the off position. And then to be safe, you want to go ahead and remove the power cords from both units. After the power cords have been removed, go ahead and disconnect the cable connecting the fast pass elevator assemblies. Then, you want to go ahead and remove the four screws for each component of the, of the uh, fast pass elevator assembly. You must remove the bottom assembly first. After you've removed all the screws, you want to go ahead and pull the bottom assembly out first. After the bottom assembly has been removed, you want to go ahead and remove the four screws of the upper assembly. Now, for this demonstration, we have already removed three of the four screws. To, to remove the, the upper assembly, you remove the, you, you remove the four screws. But first, before pulling this out, to, to be important, to avoid any damage to the elevator assembly, you want to make sure and look inside the opening from where the bottom component was and make sure that the elevator car is in the upper position. Once you've verified that the car is in the upper position, you want to go ahead and slide the assembly out.